Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but a variety of other categories too, including books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and the very occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, particularly subscription boxes, I hope that you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And that way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, which is usually at least once a day, if not twice, whenever I announce giveaways, there is always a secret password giveaway going on. And of course, whenever I go live. As always, if you're already subscribed, thanks again so much for being here and welcome back. I really appreciate those of you who watch my videos, even if you happen to have already seen the box for that month or that season on another channel. Sometimes I just can't help it. I get the boxes a little bit later than the gals on the West Coast. Sometimes I just have an abundance of boxes and so I don't get around to it. I try not to post on the same day as other people, but we don't like necessarily tell everyone about each other's schedules. So sometimes Sometimes you're kind of seeing mine at the end of a run of unboxing so I really appreciate when you just want to watch and support the channel and of course find out my take and my response to the different items that are in there so appreciated I will tell you that often it is in those videos where I know that I'm kind of at the tail end of the unboxings for the month that you might find a secret password that's the case today with the box that I had to share with you which is the journal junk box which has been sent to me for review now sometimes I consider this a stationary box we get so many beautiful uh, paper products and desk accessories but often there's a little bit of a lifestyle element in there as well the theming of this box is always on point the box itself is $53.95 per month they also have the journal junk sack which usually has the same theme but different products and that is $30.95 and then if you want all of it if you want the whole complete experience then you can get the bundle for a little bit of savings and I believe that is $71.95 I'll put all of that for you in the description box below. I do think those prices now include the shipping. I have a code for you and a link. It is Hi Noel that will save you 15%. I so appreciate when you guys are able to use those links and those codes. It helps me out in terms of my relationship with the companies and sometimes I do receive a small commission that's usually noted there in the description box. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. So the month of July is sweet happiness rules. So we're going to have some dessert themes, which I love. Now look at all of those desserts, cupcakes, ice cream, and donuts. Now, if I had to choose only one to have for the rest of my life, it would probably be ice cream. Donuts is a close second for sure. On the other side, it tells us what is in the box. So I will definitely keep that in front of me. Now, what I really love about this box is they also encourage you to use the beautiful products that they include with some journal prompts. Now, if you've been watching my channel for any amount of time, you know I am a terrible journaler, but I definitely appreciate some guided journal prompts. And it looks like this month we actually have four of them, one for each week instead of just one blanket one. So encouraging us to do maybe a little bit more. Week one, what does happiness look like to me? Uh, honestly, I am very happy right now with the life that I am living. So it looks a lot like this. It says week two, what activities make me feel happy? It doesn't make me feel happy when I'm getting ready to do it, which is any form of exercise, but I feel so happy afterwards. Week three, name three happy moments from the past month. Well, I was just on vacation, you guys, so I have way more than three. Week four, what do I think are current barriers to my happiness? Uh, letting myself get caught up in expectations of from myself or from others, obviously. All right, so inside, got a little sticker. <laughs> so we just have a little thank you card from them and then tissue paper that says hey journal babe So that's us. Hey journal babe. All right, let's open up the tissue and dive on in which I've now realized is one of the things that I say all the time along with the word definitely and actually uh, You could definitely uh, have a drinking game <laughs> going with my channel with the things that I say all the time All right, so it looks like we've got definitely a lifestyle item right here. It looks like a tumbler um, and we've got tumblers before from journal junk box I'd say almost like once a quarter in all honesty but it's always fun to get a new one for summer if you're someone like me who's active and you use your tumblers out and about you might have lost one um, I like to share them with people as well so here, wow, this one is pretty. This is from Slant Collections. Oh, and it's a collaboration with Thimble Press. Look how pretty that is. It's kind of cool because it's double walled so that print is on the inside and then it just says do your best in gold. That's something that would be very hard to photograph. Um, just kind of clear on the top and I'm sure that there is a big uh, straw hiding in here somewhere. Ooh, it's in blue. So that's gonna look kind of nice in there. So let's see what it says about this. This is the do your best 22 ounce 
double wall tumbler by slant collections it has a value of $14 the great thing about this I do find you guys that I drink a lot more water if it is out of a tumbler and a straw so that has been my trick for the last couple of years um, and so this is a nice one that you could take to the pool and maybe it has water and maybe it has an adult beverage in it who knows who knows all right let's see what else we've got in here lots of pink shred now that I got that big guy out of there there's a little bit more room to play around and check things out so one thing let me pull some of the shred out of this this is kind of a neat uh, packaging it says from cakewalk it's washi tape and twine so the twine is really pretty it's like a spiral like mint and white some fun striped uh, washi tape and then we've got some um, popsicles on this one at the top so you can almost like a rocket pop there so let me see if I can get that one to turn so you guys can see the other popsicles that are there so that is super fun in summary this would be so cute for tying up little packages or tying gift cards on um, that's kind of neat that it came on its own little like cardboard spool but I am still looking for the perfect washi tape like storage or dispenser you know like where it's a tape dispenser but like with a whole row of them that's what I need from a box. So let's see what it says. This is the Ice Lolly Washi Tape and Twine Set by Cakewalk. This has a value of $7.99. Very fun, very summery colors. I have a lot of washi tape and I don't know what to do with it. I gotta start sending out more packages for you guys. All right, this looks like an ice cream scoop shaped like an ice cream. So there's what it looks like on the back, very ice cream-like, and then here it is on the other side. So just a simple uh, plastic ice cream scoop. I usually use the metal ones now because I feel like they keep the ice cream nice and cold. Um, uh, Cone-shaped bright ice cream scoop by Fackelman France. It has a value of $10.69. This is really cute though. It could be a really fun thing to take to a party with a bunch of gallons of ice cream or gelato um, and just uh, not feel weird about like leaving it behind. So super cute. Um, very summery as well. And another example of something that's not really stationary but super adorable. Um, speaking of, this is a desk accessory. This is adorable and it is in my least favorite color, but I'm still okay with it. It's from Mad Beauty. It's a multi-purpose bag. So look how cute this is. I'm trying to move the tag. Look how cute that is, you guys. So it's like a faux leather and then they actually stitched that ice cream um, on there. That's so cute. It like actually looks like uh, ice cream waffle cone texture. So you could definitely use this for pencils. Maybe you could use it as a makeup bag. Let me just go ahead and open up the zipper and we'll see what kind of lining it has, if any. Oh, my zipper is a little bit stuck. Let me see. So maybe I can find out what it is in the meantime. Maybe it's like taped or something. Oh, it's probably taped closed. It's got the little, it's got the little plastic bit there that's keeping it keeping me from opening it so I was just wondering what I had done wrong so there it is I guess I get to keep it now so then it unzipped really easily it's just got some foam inside to keep its shape so it had, kind of has like a felt interior so you might not want to use it for your makeup brushes because it's going to get pretty messy pretty quickly but it would be a really really cute pencil case I think that is adorable or any other th kind of thing that would fit in that shape so let's see what it says about this this mad ice cream multi-purpose pouch bag by mad beauty UK has a value of $10.95 and it is adorable doesn't quite fit our ice cream scoop I, well I guess it does you could actually be very ready to go and be like oh yeah this is my ice cream scoop holder <laughs> <laughs> That'd be very, very fancy, right? Okay, what else have we got here? We also have some Note Pals sticky tabs, which are adorbs. So let me go ahead and open these up so I can share them with you. Let's see how much these were. Dainty Donuts Note Pals sticky tabs by Uli. It's a free gift. So she often includes, uh, I, I would say almost every single time she includes a free gift for us to enjoy. Sometimes it's self-care. Sometimes it's something like this. These are so cute. Look at these sticky tabs for writing your notes or if you're in a book club and you just want to mark certain pages or even in your day planner sometimes it's nice to have extra tabs so this has a value of $2.99 little extra free gift that is super cool oh my goodness we have got some oh my glitter uh 0.8 millimeter retractable glitter ink gel pens you guys I love me a gel pen you know that's like my favorite I really like to have a lot of ink when I'm writing in my different fonts that I have these might be a little bit pastel but they could also probably show up nicely on um, darker paper almost like a paint pen so let's see what it says about 
this oh my glitter gel pen set of four by Uli. Um, I just like saying Uli has <laughs> a value of $7.50. So that's pretty cute. And I like the colors. So we'll have to check that out a little bit later. Retractable. So they're just like the nice clicker kind. Um, and they have a comfort grip and they also have this like nice hook on them so that you can really um, open them up. So it's almost like a little clip there. That's really cool. Let me see. Actually, I might open them up. And while we're at it, you guys, let's have a secret password because like I, I kind of promised, I kind of hinted at having a secret password. So let's have it be glitter for this time around. So if you haven't done this before, when you come across secret passwords in my videos, you want to enter it along with your contact information in the Google form that is linked for you in the description box below. And then at the end of the month, I go through and I use a random number picker to select a few winners to receive mystery boxes full of all kinds of goodies. You have to be 18 years or older. You have to be subscribed to my channel and you have to have a US or Canadian mailing address. It is not associated with Journal Junk Box, any of the boxes that I open here or YouTube. It's just my way of saying things. Thank you so much for watching my videos in their entirety because that is what really helps me to continue growing this channel. So I did finally get the box open. Now I want to show you pen. The pen is really cute. It's got little polka dots on it and then it just clicks open. It just has that little cover on it. But then this is what this looks like. I just think that's a really cool idea for a pen. Makes it very nice and this is very um, comfortable. Like they said, that comfortable grip there um, has a little bit of softness and uh, texture to it. So let me put that off to the side. This is always one of my favorite things, you guys. So we always get sticker packs, not always, but often we get sticker packs in journal junk boxes and they're so much fun. So let's see, it says vintage pink sweet sticker pack. This has a value of $89. If you are a sticker person, you guys, this is the box for you because we get these so often. Sometimes I go through all of them, but honestly, there's probably like 30 of them here. So somebody count for me. That was a cute little compact, little vintage like glass heart. This is so cute. The Hello Kitty donut, you guys. Some perfume bottles. So definitely a lot of pink happening in these stickers. I don't know that I will necessarily use them. There's like a kitty paw. This is funny, like a little like pink gamer thing. We've got like all kinds, lots of pink, lots of like weird retro, like um, almost like kawaii things. I used to open kawaii boxes on the channel, but um, I found that I just wound up with a lot of extra stuff. But let me know if you guys are interested in ever seeing like kawaii boxes on the channel again. And super duper cute. I used to also open up a Pusheen box, which is very kawaii, but again, I just wound up with a lot of different products. So these are super cute. Oh, this is like a little like rice, a <laughs> little bear. Wow, there are so many. We might like have 50. I'm surprised she gave us the entire sticker pack. Those uh, heart shaped glasses are cute. Lots of compacts, lots of ice cream sundaes. Lots of sunglasses, lots of desserts. That strawberry shortcake there looks really good. Oh, I think at this point, you guys, I have to go through it. Lots of stuffed animals. I do like the teddy bears. I feel like these are kind of fun and like very kitschy little things that you could definitely put on different uh, gifts or kind of to decorate your day planner. Um, they look a little bit almost like shadowed, like they've been reprinted a couple of times, but I think that just kind of adds to the vintage look of them. That's really cute. That All these dessert ones are making me super duper hungry, like even the lollipop, which I am not a lollipop person. I think <laughs> they're kind of gross, honestly. I am a popsicle person though, because I don't have the patience that there's her ruby red shoes. Um, I usually just bite into them instead of just like sucking on them for a really long time. We're almost there, you guys. This is always like my fun that I have. This is, I think, like a headphones plug or container, maybe some random stuff. Fabulous, AKA me, a cassette tape. That was a good one to end with. So that's pretty cute. All right, and then I think we just have two more items. Usually at the bottom, we usually have a notepad and a notebook. This one is notes. Um, this is made by Journal Junk Box. They even have it branded here along the bottom, which I don't mind. I like the kind of watermarking that they have in the background. And it just has those same designs with those three delicious desserts, donuts, ooh, cupcakes. This has more though, besides the ice cream, we have some croissant, we have some macaron, um, all delicious things that I am craving right now. And then we also have the theme of the box in this spiral notebook that says sweet happiness rules. Very, very cute, very, very glossy. I love this design on the back. It's a little less busy. It's a little more fun. 
It's got that popsicle. So yeah, I would have loved like more stuff with this one. This one is just a little bit busier. Um, but it does have ruled pages and you guys know I prefer spiral notebooks I love the look of a bound notebook I think they look very classic like you could put them on a bookshelf but in terms of functionality I like to be able to turn the pages back and write like this and I love to be able to tear things out without ruining the binding so that is why I've switched over and decided that I prefer spiral bound notebooks and this one is super duper cute and I, I do like the theme of desserts because I am a foodie and I love my food so let's just go over th everything we got. We got our Sweet Happiness Rules Custom Journal by Journal Junk Box, value of $18.99 on that. Like, that seems a little bit high for being made in-house, but these days paper is getting really expensive, you guys. We also have our Sweet Happiness Rules Custom Notepad by Journal Junk Box. This has a value of $10.99. It is not a lot of pages, though, so I will say that. It's very, like, low on pages, which is not a bad thing. I have so many notepads, it's nice to actually use one all the way up. We have our Oh My Glitter Gel Pen which I'm actually really excited about. It's kind of fun to write and have it be sparkly on the page afterwards. We got our very abundant sticker pack. There were probably like 50 stickers in there. My favorite item in the entire box is this multi-purpose ice cream bag. We got our ice uh, washi and twine set, which was cute. Our ice cream scoop that is shaped like ice cream. Now I want ice cream. We got our double ball tumbler, which is very pretty that just says do your best and of course we got that nice little extra the note pals and these are very cute and very useful as well let me know in the comments below what you thought about this journal junk box this theme like I said she always does such a great job with the theme and the colors and I like that she customizes and creates some items for the box as well as working with some really well-known stationary brands I also love the inclusion of some of those lifestyle products in there as well so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up and I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing. If you missed it, there's a secret password. You wanna go back and find that so that you can enter to win a mystery box. See you soon.